Hello there graders, I am Miss Alicia and today we are going to talk about angles. Our learning goal for this lesson is I recognize angles and their names. So to start with the topic, I want to ask you this. What is an angle? Do you know what is an angle? No? Well, an angle is the space between two rays joined at a point called the vertex and as we can see here, this is the angle. So, here we have a house, and this house is made up of geometric shapes, such as rectangles, square, part of triangles, right? And these yellow lines are showing us all the angles that we can obtain through the use of geometric shapes. So, one more time, what is an angle? An angle is the space between two rays which join at a point called the vertex. Here we have again the picture of the angle and I want to clarify the parts of it. So we have the vertex which is the point that join the two rays, right? And the space between them is the angle. The rays are also known as sides or arms so two rays the vertex and the space between them is the angle how do we measure angles angles are measured with a special tool that is called protector the protector as we have over here comes in degrees which help us to measure the angles we have to know some type of angles, but before that, we have to clarify that angles are measured in degrees. In according their degrees are named. So we are going with the first type of angle, which is the right angle, and it measures exactly 90 degrees. This type of angles, we can find them through the use of shapes such as rectangles or squares right and the space between them are the angles we have also the reflex angles the reflex angles are between 180 degrees and 360 degrees then we go with acute angles acute angles are less than the right angle and they are between 0 degrees and 90 degrees Finally, we have the obtuse angles. Obtuse angles are between 90 degrees and 180 degrees. As we could see through all of them, they have different degrees and according to their degrees, they are named. So we have some angles have a special names that you need to remember. We have acute angle less than 90 degrees obtuse angle between 90 and 180 degrees reflex angle more than 180 degrees right angle 90 degrees exactly a straight line angle that is 180 degree whole turn angle that is 360 degrees these two that we didn't see before that is when we have the angle and we take one of the rays and we up complete it and we form the straight line angle and then the whole turn that means that it goes all around until we close it to get the 360 degrees so these are the type of angles that we were learning through this lesson remember we have acute obtuse reflex right straight and full tone angles remember that we measure angles with the use of a protector right which comes in the degrees to help us with the measuring of angles so i hope we have we have learned the name of the angles and what is an angle as well so thank you very much for your attention the
Imagine. 